Hi, Chris Yoder here with Custom Body Bootcamp, and I want to give you a workout that you can do at home when you can't make it to boot camp class. So this is a cardio circuit, and it's one that will get your heart rate up, get you sweating, get you feeling good. And first off, you're going to want to look, download an interval timer onto your phone so you can go through the intervals. And what you're going to want to download is 20 seconds of exercise and 10 seconds of rest. And then you're going to want to set that for 36 times or 48. So if you go through it three times, it'll be 36. If you go through it four times, it will be 48 exercises. I recommend just going through three, but if you want a little bit more of a challenge, you can go through four. So uh, we have 12 different exercises, and the goal is, is to do each exercise for 20 seconds and then do 10 seconds off. So we have 12 different exercises and you just go. So find just a space that you can do the exercise and have a little room to run and do some bear pose, and I'll explain what those are in a second. So the way it's gonna work is, first we're going to have jumping jacks. So you're gonna start off, start off with jumping jacks, just basic jumping jacks, 20 seconds of exercise, and then you get 10 seconds of rest, and your phone will be beeping as you're doing these. The next one is, you're going to go down to number two, you're going to do bicycle crunches, so hands behind the head, you're going to twist over towards your right elbow to the left knee, come back to the center, twisting over to the other side. That will be number two, 20 seconds on, again 10 seconds off. The next one is going to be high knees, so you can either walk these, or you can do running high knees here, again 20 seconds on, 10 seconds off. Then we're going to do reverse crunches, so you're going to lay down on your back, draw your knees in towards your chest. Kind of just let it come back down the center. Exhale as you pull in, and inhale as you release. So, and then next one is gonna be mountain climbers. So mountain climbers, hands directly under your shoulders, trying to keep your back straight. Drawing your knees up into the chest. You can go fast, you can either go slow. If you need to rest, you can't quite come through it, go into it, come down the hands and knees. Next one is gonna be fire feet. So fire feet is squat down a little bit. Your feet are a little bit wider than the hips. Squat down, you can keep your hands at your chest. Don't round as you're doing this, sitting up nice and tall. Just getting the feet going as fast as you can. 20 seconds on, 20 seconds off. They're called fire feet because your feet should feel like they are on fire. Okay, the next one is going to be squats. So squats are gonna, so as you're doing squats, the key is, is making sure you're reaching the hips back. Don't come forward or you're gonna tear up your knees. Try to keep your weight into your heels. So inhaling down, exhaling up, inhale down, 20 seconds of those, 10 seconds off. The next one is going to be knee, knee, toe, toe. It looks a little confusing. It usually took me about 10 minutes to get these things, but just doing high knees again. So just high knees and then you go knee, knee, toe, toe. Still takes me a little while to get it now and then. So knee, knee, toe, toe, knee, knee, toe, toe, and then you can get it going as fast as you want there. So that one is knee, knee, toe, toe. Then we're gonna go down to the next one, number nine, which is gonna be crunches. You're just gonna do crunches for 20 seconds and then 10 seconds off. <clears throat> and the next one is gonna be bear crawls. So you just get the plank position and you just walk, trying to keep your hips close to the floor, walk up a few, and then walk back a few. So that one's gonna be number 10. Then we're gonna do runs. So you just find a little area that you can run from. Just gonna run down to one side, touching on the floor. Right down to the other, 20 seconds on, 10 seconds off. And then the last one is plank. So lower plank, try to keep your back straight. Alternating lifting the legs. If you're not ready for that, start from the knees. You can even start from tabletop. So, but if you're gonna do planks, just try to hold plank if you're strong enough. Alternate lifting the legs back and forth. That again will be 20 seconds on, 10 seconds off. So this will give you a great, this will definitely get your heart rate up. I'm breathing a little hard now as I'm having trouble trying to talk, but um, this will get you going, get you sweating, and it's a great workout that you can do if you can't make it to boot camp. So good luck, and next time we'll see you in here in boot camp.